Hi everyone. This video demonstrates arrangement of mandibular posterior teeth. We'll be starting with the setting of mandibular first permanent molar. To do this, start by marking the area in the wax opposing the maxillary first molar. Soften a wax spatula and remove the wax between these two lines. Make a soft pool of wax and arrange the mandibular first molar in such a way that the mesial buccal cusp of maxillary first molar coincides with the buccal groove on the mandibular first molar. Here you can see that the mesial buccal cusp of maxillary molar coincides with the buccal groove of mandibular molar. Do spend some time to get this class 1 molar relation absolutely correct. This is also called the key of occlusion. Turn the articulator and check the occlusion from behind to see that you have a perfect lingual occlusion too. Once everything is satisfactory, seal the wax all around the tooth to set it firmly. Second molar is set in a similar manner. If you have got the key of occlusion correct, then automatically rest of the mandibular teeth will align perfectly. Move on to setting the mandibular first and second premolars. After each mandibular tooth is placed, close the articulator and verify that the occlusion is correct. Also make sure the vertical pin touches the incisal table. Make sure the occlusion is tight both from the buccal and lingual aspect without any gaps. Complete the arrangement on the opposite side in a similar manner. So if all the guidelines were followed correctly, you will be able to see that the central force of all the teeth are in a straight line and it aligns with the center of the ridge as well as with the reference mark we had made on the landline of the cast initially. That completes maxillary and mandibular teeth arrangement. Stay tuned for demo of wax up carving and finishing. Thank you.